Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympic exponential equation problem and here we have 9 to the power of m plus 1 minus 9 to the power of m minus 1 equals 20 and we solve this problem for the values of m. So here uh, the very first step we are going to do is here first we break uh, the exponents of both of these terms and it is written as 9 to the power of m into 9 to the power of 1 minus 9 to the power of m into 9 to the power of minus 1 equals to 20 and after this step uh, you see here we have uh, we just take the common uh, 9 to the power of m and the remaining terms are 9 minus 9 inverse and this is equals to 20. So in the next step uh, we have uh, this is 9 to the power of m into 9 minus we uh, move this 9 inverse in this form 1 over 9 and it is equals to 20. Here we take the LCM of this term and it is written as 9 to the power of m into here the LCM is 9 and we get 9 9 is 81 minus 9 is equals to 20. So we need some simplification and it is written as 9 to the power of m into 81 minus 1 equals to 80 over 9 and this whole equation equals to 20. So here uh, we need to remove 80 over 9 from uh, left hand side so that uh, here uh, we need to multiplying uh, both of the sides by 9 over 80. So when you multiplying both of the sides by 9 over 80, so it is written as in this form 9 to the power of m multiplied by 9 over 80 into 80 over 9 equals to 9 over 80 into 20. Okay, so here you see that this 80 is cancelled out by this 80, this 9 is cancelled out by this 9 and we get 9 to the power of m equals to these are cancelled out by each other and we get 9 divided by 4. So after that here we need uh, some simplification here and uh, first we write this 9 as 3 square and its whole power m and now we write this 9 over 4 as 3 over 2 square. Okay after this step here we need to uh, multiply these two exponents and it is written as 3 to the power of 2m equals to 3 over 2 and its whole square. So here uh, in order to find the value of m we need to take the uh, log on both of the sides of this equation. So when we take the log on both of the sides it is written as log of 3 to the power of 2m equals to log of 3 over 2 and its whole square. So after that uh, here we use the nice properties of log and we move this exponent 2m in the front of this log and it is written as 2m into log 3 is equals to here we move this 2 in the front of this log and it is written as 2 times of log 3 over 2. So here uh, you see on both of the sides and we uh, uh, we have this 2 is cancelled out by this 2 and we get m times of log 3 is equals to here we use the nice property of log and we write this expression as log of 3 minus log of 2 and now here we uh, eliminate this log 3 from left hand side so that we divide both of the sides by log 3 and it is written as in this form m, d, m log 3 divided by log 3 and it is equals to log 3 minus log of 2 and it is divided by log of 3. So uh, in the next step you see here this log is cancelled out by this log 3 and it is written as m is equals to here we break this fraction and we write it as log of 3 divided by log of 3 minus log of 2 divided by log of 3. Okay so this log 3 is cancelled out by this log 3 
and we have the value of m is equals to 1 minus we write this uh, we apply the property of log 2 over log 3 and we write it as log of base 3 into 2 so this is the value of m which we get uh, this is the final answer of uh, of the given equation and now in the next step we verify uh, this value of m so to verify this value of m is this value of m is satisfied over the given question statement or not so that now we uh, we just substitute the value of m in the given equation so uh, first we copy down the given question statement it is 9 to the power of m plus 1 minus 9 to the power of m minus 1 equals to 20. so here we substitute this value of m in the left hand side and it is written as in this form so this is 9 to the power of m and the value of m is 1 minus log 3 2 and this is plus 1 and similarly minus we substitute this value on this exponent m and it is written as 1 minus log base 3 into 2 minus 1 equals to 20. So here we need more simplifications and first we focus on this term and it is written as 9 and 1 plus 1 becomes 2 minus log 3 and square minus and so this negative one and positive one are cancelled by each other and we get 9 to the power of minus log 3 2 and this is equals to 20. Okay, so in the next step here we need to uh, break this fraction and it is written as 9 square into 9 to the power of minus log 3 2 minus 9 to the power of minus log 3 into 2 equals to 20. So here you see that uh, this term is common so uh, here we take it common this one and we get 9 to the power of minus log 3 2 and the remaining terms are 9 square minus 1 equals to 20. So in the next step here we, uh, uh, we rewrite this expression as in this form so this is 9 we write it as 3 square and its whole power minus log 3 2 and the 9 square equals to 81 minus 1 equals to 20. So here we interchange uh, these two exponents and we write it as 3 to the power of log 3 into 2 and its whole exponent minus 2. So this is 81 minus 1 becomes 80 and this whole equals to 20. And now in the next step here uh, we use the nice property of log uh, on this term so uh, the output of this term is equals to 2 and its whole power minus 2 and we move this 80 in the right hand side and it is written as 20 over 80 okay so these are cancelled by each other 24 is 80 and uh, we write this term as 1 over 4 so here we write it as 1 over 4. So this means that left hand side is equal to right hand side. This shows that the value of x satisfied the given equation. And this is the final answer. And thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.